Hello, my dudes. I'm feeling angry. Angry. Very angry. I'm. I'm sick of people lowballing me on Carousel. These people need to stop now. No more lowballing. But how do I stop it? That's it. I need to fight fire with fire. I need to become an anti hero and remind people how ridiculous it is to lowball people on online marketplaces such as Carousel. And how am I gonna do that? By becoming a lowballer myself. For those of you who don't know what Carousel is, it's basically an online marketplace, something like eBay but without the auctioning bit. So today, I'm gonna immerse myself into the mind of a lowballer. Okay, first I'm gonna need to come up with a username. Lowballer. Lowballer. Okay, sounds good. Is this gonna be too obvious? If someone calls me out on this, I'm gonna have to abort mission immediately. Fuck! <laughs> Okay, so we have a problem. In order to create a new account, I need to actually register with a new mobile number. So I'm just gonna use my personal account. Yeah, so this is my profile. Look at that, 4.9 out of 5. I'm a good, I'm a good buyer, okay? I'm a good Carousel user. Not anymore. <laughs> okay, so let's start. I'm gonna go to electronics. Ooh, airpods. I could use an airpod. Apple airpods 2. I'll purchase it for $20. Ah, I feel so bad doing this. Hey yo, what the fuck? We'll, we'll see what he says. Hey, okay, what else? Oh, a new laptop. Nitro i7 4720 with a GTX 960. 899. Ooh, that's a bit out of my budget. I was thinking maybe $50, but you know, I'm feeling a bit generous today. Let's go with $150. Oh man, I'm still not used to this. Ooh, okay, come on. I'm a lowballer. Immerse in the mind of a lowballer. <sighs> come on, I'm a lowballer. Okay, I'm gonna try something different. I don't wanna just offer the price. I'm gonna ask if it's available first. Hi, is this still available? Oh, we got an instant reply. Uh, okay. I really like the iPhone 11. I'll offer you $350. <laughs> yeah. I'm a low baller. Let's go. I sell $1,420. $350 by the box, is it? <laughs> Does the box come with Wi Fi? I need a device with internet. This person's gonna think I'm crazy. Just put your brain inside the box, can detect Wi-Fi. <gasps> oh, an iPhone 10. Not really a fan of the product photography. Not re really a fan of the product photography. I'll offer you $150. Okay. Oh, a Seiko watch. $120? Off-white Nike sneakers. Let's ask if it's available. Okay, the Seiko watch guy replied. He just, he just laughed. <laughs> Is that a deal? Oh, the Nike sneakers dude replied to, Yes bro, it's in my car. Do you want to deal today? Yes, today is great. I'll do it for $90. <laughs> Let's see what he says. $90. Yes. Deal? The price is $750, not $90. I need to get that pair of sneakers. I need to. Okay, I gotta use my sales tactic. What did all the insurance agents that have approached me taught me? Uh, last price. He just MIA. He ghosted on me. Guess my sales tactic was too strong. So the Seiko guy replied again. I asked if I could buy the shred for $20. And he sent me a picture of another shred. This camo looking one. But that's not what I came for. Camo design doesn't go well with my blue skin. This is nice camo, look cool. So how $20 deal? And he completely ignored the fact that I have blue skin. 
Okay, I got two more replies from two other things that I DM. People on Carousel actually reply quite fast and very readily. That's good, I guess. I DM the guy for the Sony A7 III. I told him, I'll get this off your hands for 1007 And he said, thanks for the offer. I'm selling 3.6 for everything, not 1.7 of your intended price. Cheers. Okay, I'll meet you in the middle at 1.2K. Oh, I'm so gonna get my ass beaten. For the lens you meant, no for everything. <laughs> yeah, this guy said, hee hee, are you feeling feverish? Too much Chinese New Year goodies. <laughs> My mom bought a lot of pineapple hearts and bagua. Do you want some? Uh, I'm so happy that this guy <laughs> appreciates the sense of humor. Oh my god, this guy is hilarious. <laughs> okay, I'm at the music section. I feel that musicians tend to be more chill, like, you know, and they won't be like super pissed off. Because I really don't want to piss people off. So far, it's been going good. No one is legit angry. They either just ignore or they caught on to the joke pretty early. A Yamaha semi-acoustic guitar. Oh, that looks nice. Love the guitar. Let's meet in the middle. Which is where? No, I mean the price. I'll offer you $220. And the original price was $465. And $220 isn't even in the middle. Oh, too low, brother. I can do $400. Wow, that's quite a discount from $465 to $400. How about $220 and 5 boxes of pineapple hearts? That's a good deal. I wanted to fold up and stop. Oh, look at this sick guitar. My girlfriend will call me sire if I own this guitar. Nice, lol. Thank you, sir. Will you make my dreams come true and let it go at $350? <laughs> at $350, please keep dreaming. Whoa, this is sick. What? Wow, looks amazing. Holy shit. Well, this guy is really an audiophile, uh, a serious guitarist. I'll purchase it for $2,000 and throw in 2 kgs of Fa Kwa. And he said $2,000 and a year supply of grocery. And we have a deal. Okay, final offer $2,000 plus 2 kgs of Fa Kwa plus 5 boxes of pineapple hearts. Add in 50 cans of premium abalone can do. <laughs> How much is 50 cans of premium abalone? You know, that that actually might be worth it. Like $2,000 and 50 cans of premium abalone. It is so funny bargaining with Chinese New Year goodies. Nike Claude Air Force One Rose Gold. I don't know, is that a popular shoe? I'm not really into hype stuff. But it's a thousand dollars, thousand four for a pair of sneakers. But what's even better is his username, Kobe Briani. RIP Kobe. No way, no way anyone should spend a thousand dollars on a pair of sneakers. Okay, I'm gonna hit this guy up. Hey, love the shoes. Still available? Kobe Briani has replied. Are you willing to let it go at two hundred dollars? No. He is visibly confused. $200? Question mark. $200 for the pair of sneakers. <laughs> okay, because I love Kobe and Briani, final final price, $320. He said, oh man, sorry, I don't deal with no personal info. What personal info can I give you? I like basketball. My O-level score. Just throwing a random number here. 18. <laughs> Sorry to hear it's only 18. Oof, he just burned me. Why are you so mean? Maybe if I act like completely oblivious, the response wouldn't be so negative. Bad days as I've had a lot of low volus. Oh shit! <laughs> He's the first person that actually caught on to my username. Wow. Good job, dude. <laughs> well done. <laughs> <laughs> I did not expect that. I did not expect that. <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah, I think that's it for today's video. That's a great ending. <laughs> um, okay, and that's about it for the video. Most of the people didn't reply and I totally get it because I wouldn't respond to my ridiculous requests as well. <laughs>
But yeah, I did end up telling people that actually spent time talking to me that I'm making a YouTube video and most of them were really cool about it. A lot of people caught on to what I was doing. It's good to know that people have a sense of humor, especially when dealing with online marketplaces where it can get a bit, you know, heated. Like there are so many stories of low ballers and, you know, deals gone wrong online. It's nice to see that people can still joke around on these marketplaces. I mean, not saying that you should actually just lowball and waste people time but <sighs> that's actually that's what I did but anyway hope you enjoyed this video and to all the carousellers who I terrorized um, I'm sorry <laughs> okay peace guys ew that's so lame just wanted to drop in real quick because um, as I was editing this video, one of my older videos uh, where I talked about the 16 personalities, the MBTI test, it actually blew up and it became my highest viewed video in my entire channel. Hello to all the new fans that, uh, that have come across my channel and I realized that a lot of you guys are from many different parts of the world so hi and I'm really honored that you guys are actually watching my shit <laughs> and yeah that's all I wanted to say. Bye.